podcast B type novi. Hi guys, welcome back to the platform. Welcome to today's video. Moni Kanane Jessica Riat. I don't know if I said that right. Okay, and I'm trying to say my name is Jessica Riat. So if I say that right, let me know in the comment section. Okay, all right. So we are going to be reacting on Polish dish to try what to eat in Poland, best food to eat in Poland. Yeah. I hope you enjoyed this video with me. Please give the video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, like, share, and comment, and um, let's get started. Mom? Thanks for joining me for today's video. This video will be about what we recommend you okay. eat on your trip to Poland. Most of those dishes you can get in all parts of Poland, so wherever you plan on going, you're just going to need to pick the right restaurant and try it. Those of you who are here for the first time, my name is Marta from Cooking the World. We produce one video a week, so if you like what you've seen this far, I would appreciate if you click the subscribe button down below and the notification bell for more content about traditional food. Let's move to Polish dishes. Polish cuisine is rich in meat and winter vegetables. We eat a lot of potatoes, dumplings and grains. The preparation of most of the dishes mm. is very time consuming, but on the other hand, they taste like heaven. We will start with krokietki. Krokietki are pan-breaded pancakes filled Bacon. either with meat and vegetables mm. or sauerkraut and mushrooms. Nice. They are served warm with clear beetroot soup on the side. The filling is very juicy and they are oh. very crispy from outside. The next dish that is worth trying is pierogi ruskie. Pierogi ruskie are dumplings full ah. with potato, quark and onions. Usually, they serve with chopped fried onions on the top and sour cream on the side. You can also find pierogi filled with meat and vegetables, sauerkraut and mushrooms, as well as berries. My favorite one are the first mentioned. Not even the meat can beat the excellent mm -hmm. potato quark filling. Gołąbki, which you translate to pigeons, are made from boiled cabbage leaves wrapped around a filling of minced pork or beef, mm. chopped onions and rice. Usually, they are served with tomato sauce on the side. Poles also have Christmas version of gołąbki that is made from mushrooms and cooked wow. rice, which is my favorite. Important soup to mention is żurek. The soup is made from sourdough, smoked bacon, boiled sausage, egg and potatoes. Meals are so juicy. Okay, the first meal was with breadcrumbs. Okay, like your that is... The outside looks crispy, then she opened the inside, the inside is amazing. Then Pyogi, I've done a lot of video about Pyogi and this one too looks amazing to eat and to chew. And the one she's eating with the tomato sauce and rice, like she said there was rice inside, the tomato sauce, like you, epic. Like Polish food as <laughs> are super super inviting, okay. I am loving what I am seeing and um, I'm going to be writing a list of food, definitely, that I will try whenever I come to Poland, okay? And if you watch this time, thank you so much for watching, okay? I did a reaction about Polish food and I did ask about a recipe. I could not able to, to make that recipe because the ingredients, I could not find most of the ingredients here in my country. So I had to skip that recipe. Yeah, so that's why you've not seen it in my community because i promised i'll put that in my community but because i could not make it that is why it's not in my community okay guys so i just want to let you guys know okay yeah all right so let's keep on watching Zurek is traditionally eaten for easter but it's also popular in other times of the year the soup is thick and has a sour taste i love it Another traditional dish that has to be mentioned is bigos. Bigos. Bigos is a cabbage stew made from sauerkraut, cabbage and different kind of meats. At my home, it was usually served with bacon and fried sausage. Vitri versions contain beef and pork cubes, as well as mushrooms. Potato pancakes with sour cream are very popular in Poland. Potato I am pancakes. aware of the fact that this is the national dish of Belarus and that they are very well known in East and Middle Europe. But I think that the way they served in Poland is very particular. Wow. In Poland, potato pancakes are half centimeter thin and the potatoes are very finely grated, what gives them the fantastic texture. Looks they are crispy from crazy. outside and soft from inside. Usually they serve with sour cream on the side or beef stew. Kotlet de volaille is fried chicken filled with butter or cheese, 
coated with flour, eggs and breadcrumbs. The dish, despite French name, has been developed in Russia and came to Poland after Second World War. Oh my goodness. Just look how this cheese melts! On the side you can see traditional Polish cucumber salad, Miseria. Miseria is made salad. from slice of grated cucumbers, sour cream, spiced with salt, pepper, dill, vinegar and sugar. Wow! The mixture is very refreshing and you... That's um... Cucumber salad. Or oh, I call it cucumber salad or I call it cucumber soup. It looks so 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 creamy, okay? It looks pretty pretty creamy. I love the 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 meal she's dishing out for us. They look amazing, and the chicken with this tough cheese inside, like is I think it's like a raw chicken. They like the, the chicken breast, the meat, um, cheese inside. Roll it, put bread crumbs, egg, flour, bread crumbs, and fry it. Let me know if I'm right about this recipe, okay? It looks so, so juicy. I love the side that they are using it with the mashed potato at the side. Pretty awesome. So guys, let's keep on watching. Usually served with breaded pork tenderloin and potatoes. Rosu is rich liquid made of water Rosu. in which bones, meat and vegetables has been simmered. The broth is served as a starter on every Sunday in Silesian families, followed by filled rolled beef served with potato dumplings. The rolls are filled with nice. pickled cucumber, mustard and smoked bacon cubes. My grandmother secured the rolled meat with a strand, so we had to be careful not to eat it. The list of traditional Polish dishes is long, therefore I couldn't include all of them in this video. I think that all wow. the dishes mentioned are a great start for you to discover Polish cuisine. If you are looking for traditional Polish recipes, please check the description box below. I have included some links for you. I wish you a great trip to Poland and I hope you enjoy Polish food. The meals were calling my name. <laughs> they look so, so incredible, amazing. Okay, I literally enjoyed this. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section. Let me know your favorite meal, okay? If you're from Poland, Please drop in the comment section your favorite meal. Yes. And um, I'll see you all in my next video. Yes. Chakuyem do Bye, guys.